Hey, hey, fam. Thank y'all so, so much for being here with me, tuning in and tapping in. Y'all already know who and what it is, so let's just go ahead and tap in with Spear, get this tea for y'all real quick. See what's really going on in this general collective energy. But before we start, fam, I just wanted to take a minute to give y'all y'all flowers. Of course, I can't give you flowers individually, but I just wanted to say thank you for each and every one of you guys for all the love and the support and everything. I just, you know, just thank you. If no one is giving you flowers, you know, here recently, here you go. I'm giving you flowers, fam. Thank y'all so much. Like from the bottom of my heart, for real, for real. I love each and every one of y'all. But let's go ahead and get into this. Y'all already know, whatever message comes out, it's always general. So take what resonates and leave the rest, fam. Also, the messages are always timeless. So whenever you come across this message, fam, that's exactly when Spirit has it for you. To all the subscribers and members of the channel, I thank y'all so, so much for rocking and rolling with me. Even if you're not subscribed, fam, or a member, I thank you for just coming and viewing the message, 111. I greatly appreciate each and every one of you guys, like real shit. <laughs> but let's go ahead and get into this. Oh my goodness, my sinuses are bothering me so, so bad, child. But let's get into this. Holy Spirit, cool child. <laughs> Y'all, I just heard something about watch out for them internet hoes. Not trolls, but internet hoes. Oh, good goodness. What we finna do? Yeah. So, this is feeling like somebody feel like they y'all have unfinished business. That's exactly what this is. It's somebody that y'all possibly met on the internet or I don't know where you met this person at. But this is somebody that feel like y'all have unfinished business right here. For one reason or another. Holy Spirit. Let's get into this. Whomever this person is, fam. I don't if you have children, why do it feel like this person and feel like y'all got unfinished business, got a problem with the person you have children with? Or even with the person that you just dealing with right now. The person in spirit saying is that's putting a smile on your face. So that give me the energy of whomever this is that feel like y'all got unfinished business. They watch you. Because how would they know? Holy Spirit, what's the message here? I got to level out this table, bro. I don't even know how it got unleveled. Yeah, we got the hangman right here. Pisces energy to the six of wands. Yeah, to the truth, that's what I'm saying. It's like somebody that can't let something go until they... I also heard something about meeting a quota. I don't know what the heck that means. But yeah, it's like somebody can't let something go until they... What, what the hell is the victory? What is this? Let's see here. Holy Spirit. Because is this, this is like this person trying to conquer you or something? Yeah, we got the two of wands right here. The queen of swords. The queen of cups. To the ten of cups. Wait a minute. <laughs> what is this unfinished business? Who is this person in your family? Some of y'all, this is a mother figure. But why do this mother figure feel like, okay, Unfinished business. Oh, shut the damn door. Y'all look at these cards and they come up in the reverse. Happiness in the reverse. Peace in the reverse. Disappointment in the reverse. Then we got the nine of swords right here. Y'all, what the hell is this? Because it really do feel like it's somebody out here that has tried to make your life a living hell. And you still smiling. So it's like this person is like, y'all have unfinished biz, kind of like finish her or some shit. The fuck? Yo, somebody is definitely not getting something they want. So it's like they can't rest. But what is this also? Because we got, you know, rest in peace. So what is this about you still being alive? 
You know what, fam? Look at this right here. This is, you know what? I, I don't like the messages that's coming out here because why is somebody mama being so mean and rude or this mother figure? But this is feeling uh, just specifically like somebody mama. I don't know if somebody mama didn't was not happy when they found out that they was pregnant or something. Somebody, it just keep coming out that somebody mama did not want them. And that's why they treated them that way. But why in the fuck do this crazy bitch feel like y'all got unfinished business? Because she couldn't ruin your fucking life? You're still smiling? You're still happy? Yeah, we got truce right here to the Knight of Pentacles. So, fam, no, fuck that. Fuck all the... I'm sorry. I'm trying to work on my cussing, y'all. But, you know, this kind of stuff don't make no sense to me. and need to get, really get under my skin. There's somebody here. You really don't speak to your mother or you speak to her sporadically or something like that. I don't know what's going on or whomever this person is. It looks like they're going to contact you or try to get in touch with you. This Some of y'all, I ain't going to lie to you. This is energetically. So somebody here, this person right here, this mother figure, they're trying to speak to you like telepathically or something like that. That's why it's like y'all heard somebody call y'all name and you like looked up and then you like, what the fuck? Because you know you heard your mama voice. Somebody's mother dibbles and dabbles in like different shit. This is also like finish everything on your plate. Like, what is going on here? Or either this is like somebody getting like full meals and then somebody having to eat like noodles or some shit. So let's say somebody ever eating steak and potatoes and then they give somebody else noodles. Like, what, what the fuck are we doing here? This is giving like some. See, don't, uh uh. Nope. No. No, 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 no. This mother figure right here, or whomever this person is, looks like a mother figure to me. This person is coming back around to cipher your energy, try to steal your power. So somebody right here, while you were younger, it's like they fed off of you. Somebody here, they, they had intended on completely depleting you. And I don't know... Child, this is uh, holy. Yeah, look, we get the seven of swords right here. We got uh, holy spirit. Do some of y'all mamas got like keys to y'all house, or do y'all live with this person? Yeah, we got peace. We got two seven two, two two seven seven two two. Yeah, we get Sagittarius energy here. I'm telling you, somebody here is like, I come in peace. And no, the fuck they don't. Somebody is lying. Somebody still feel like they got some type of control over you. Or they should. Man, I just I, I can't I can't sit up here and tell y'all. Yeah, Libra energy right here. I can't sit up here and tell y'all that I don't feel what the fuck it is I'm feeling. Somebody out here, they dibble and dabble in, in magic. I see somebody mixing some shit. It's like, yeah, I don't know what it is that they're mixing here. Also, it's something here about taking a baby to the park and making sure they don't skin their knee. Yeah, something here at the playground is faulty. So y'all might want to be mindful of the parks or something that you take your children to because it's something here that's faulty and it could cause some type of injury to the children. This is craziness. It's like some uh, who is this who mama cut their hair off and sent them? Somebody mama means fuck. Like but it's kind of feeling like the worse that she made you feel as a child, the better she felt or looked or something. Because I want to show y'all something. Y'all know I read intuitively like a sum of my bitch. Look at this. It's like some, I keep telling y'all whoever this mother figure is, they want to come in and sign for your energy. Somebody here, they use your energy for their beauty or something like that. So it's like somebody could be looking uh, older now, but... 
your energy. Something is about blood. Mm. Somebody used to have a lot of accidents as, as a child. I don't really feel like these were accidents, though. Some of y'all, they could have been, but some ain't right here. All I know is whomever this person is. Yeah, somebody could be around the ages of 22. We get, uh, I, I see 2022 20, as well. 2010, 2022, 20, 20, uh, 17. Spirit said 2016. Thank you. Yeah, we get the two of pentacles. I'm telling y'all what the fuck it is I know. Somebody right here, this is even like this person don't even have to be in your presence. Somebody right here, they try to cipher your energy from a distance. It's like through some type of telepathic something or another. Like, I'm not, I don't even know. I see 11, 11. Yeah, this person right here. So it's like, I don't know if this person is like showing up at your house unannounced. I'm sorry, at your home unannounced. If this person is just like uh, doing something, I, I'm telling you, I feel it. Somebody doing something energetically, y'all. So I'm saying it's like telepathic, keeping your, it's like something with your mind and you know, magic will fuck with your head and that's how they get it to work. So it's like whatever this person was doing previously, they're about to try to do that shit again. And you know what? We got that moon and at the blood, 1144, the blood moon happens tomorrow on the 17th. Yeah. Leo energy right here with the sun card. Somebody finna try to cipher your energy fam. It's not going to work. This person is going to hit a major fucking tower when they try to come for you. Look, look at that. The devil. Ten of Pentacles. What's that behind the devil? Yeah, the Aeon. This is also about somebody touching you. Y'all, be mindful of your dreams because I do feel like it's something in your dreams that somebody's going to try to either give you something or touch you. It's very important for you not to accept whatever this is that somebody's trying to give you in your dream. And you damn sure know that you shouldn't be letting nobody touch you. Because whomever this mother figure is, they need your energy in order to keep their youth or their vibrance or something like this. Something because it's fading. They're light. Shit, abundance, period. Something here is fading. It's failing for this person. Spirit even said health. So, yeah, whomever this mother figure is, they're coming in again, fam, to try to cipher energy from you. Yeah, five of pentacles. Look at this. The queen of pentacles. Somebody here is about finances. I just heard some. It's a mother figure. I feel like somebody owed them. So somebody it's important. It's, this is important because somebody it's something about the ages of five. Somebody here. Your mother didn't uh, find out she was pregnant with you until five months. The month of May is also significant here. So someone could be like Taurus. Gemini. Mm. Capricorn. Yeah, see, like, it's like, you see how those three children are right there? You got one that's back there behind that. See, this is the thing right here. This mother figured and fucked up. Because it's like you could have other siblings, two, three, four, ten. I don't know how many siblings you have. Some of y'all got siblings. And it's like your mother favorites your siblings over you. This, this mother fucked up because you are the one that they were supposed to be protecting and shielding. Yeah, but instead of that, they used your ass. They used your energy and everything. You know what? I just heard something else, too. Oh, my goodness. Somebody right here, your mother. Oh, man. Damn. I don't... This is giving like somebody could be religious, but why is my getting that somebody right here has a, had a spiritualist? And it's like, when your mother found out that she was pregnant with you, like I told you, some of y'all mothers, I'm, I'm trigger warning. I'm sorry, but I got to get a message is how, how it's given to me. Your mother did not want another child. But whomever this spiritualist is, 
It's like you're the problem solver. You're the you're the one to end this person's problems. So your mother kept you. And I'm guaranteeing from that point on, her life got a lot fucking better. 15, 15. Ever since you were born, your mother's life improved. But now there's a lack and she needs your energy again. So some of y'all, this mother figure knows that, no, there's the cord has been cut. You've made peace with the situation. There's no way for her to physically come around you. So now it's about her mentally draining. So some of y'all could be like really confused or something or feeling like really exhausted. Yes, yeah, like your daily routine is just like overwhelming to you. Cleanse your energy. Because whomever this is, they're using the energy that we're about to get with this moon in order to try to feed off of you again. Yeah, block it. The game master. You cannot, yeah, protect yourself from this person. Yeah, and whatever this work is that they're about to try to do. I heard something about configurations. So, so I don't know, something here's significant about figure skating. Somebody is also, it's something about somebody's weight. So I don't uh I don't know if your mother has lost a lot of weight or gained a lot of weight or whatever this is. Or you know, this could be something that's happening with you. It could be your appetite. Yeah, somebody's appetite. It's like you're not as hungry or something like that. If you're like thicker or BBW or something, your mother is um jealous of your figure or whomever this mother figure is. So B BBW, if you're thin, I don't know, but it's just like this person is going to try to affect your weight in one way or another. So it's like somebody right here, they turning away from the table. Somebody going to the diet like, I don't know why I can't stop eating. I'm exercising and everything, but I can't lose any weight. That's what's going on. It's just a mother figure in your energy pulling on you in order to... um. Shit, pretty much just help herself. That's weird as fuck. Yeah. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles. This could definitely be about finances. But this is about your abundant energy. This is about strength. Somebody could be having health issues. They're trying to... It's like uh, endurance or something like that. Somebody... You know what? Your mother knows how special you are. And for some reason... This crazy person does not feel like it's a big deal for them to pull on your energy because it's like you're strong enough. You can take it. So your mother actually, if you have siblings out of all your siblings, your mother feels like you're the strongest and definitely knows that you are uh, spiritually gifted. Your energy. Yeah, it keeps this person afloat. It has been for years. Yeah, and to some of y'all cut them cords or whatever. Yeah. Also, it's something here about something that you posted. And this, you know what? It's like this person, like, I bet you I can. I bet you I can. Yeah, somebody right here, it's like they're challenging you as well. Yeah, it's something here about a protest. So I don't know if you, like, <laughs> exposing your mama about something. We saw that sun court. But yeah, it's like I'm I, I'm not taking your shit anymore. Pretty much is what it is. <laughs> and somebody, mama, like, what? Who you talking to? Yeah, shit like that. Something that could be significant about the ages twelve and seventeen. Between twelve and and uh, seventeen, twelve, fifteen, seventeen. Somebody could be like twenty two, twenty seven, twenty five as well. Seventy two, seventy seven. I got two, two, two out here, seven, seven. Yeah. Balance your energy out, fam. Like, seriously. Some of y'all could, I'm hearing scatterbrained. It's like over here, over there. Like, you can't get yourself. Like, you just like, and it's like frustrating. Like, oh, yeah. Cleanse your energy. Let's get one more card, please. Holy Spirit. Can I get one more card from this deck, please? Thank you. Gave me two. Yeah, we got the Knight of this to the Four of uh, Swords right here. Mm. I'm telling you, this is giving like peaceful sleep. Like, <laughs> seriously. Hmm. 
I just, you know what? I know what the night of this means, but if y'all just, I, again, I read intuitively. Some of y'all are finna ignore the hell out of a phone call. It's like you're gonna see somebody's name come across your goddamn caller ID, and you're gonna be like, nah, bruh. Mm -mm. It feel like some of y'all just gonna like put the phone down. I don't, I don't know if you're gonna ignore the call. Some of y'all gonna ignore the call. Some of y'all just gonna ignore the ringing of the phone. Yeah, some somebody here cooking is it provides you a lot of peace. Hmm. Yeah, you know, and also when I say a mother figure, some of y'all, it don't have to be a mother figure. It can be a father. There's no gender to wrong. This could be a father figure. Hell, this could be somebody that you have children with. Don't have to be somebody that gave birth to you. So when I'm saying somebody right here, they didn't want a child. Somebody could have found out you were pregnant and they didn't want this child. But then they went to some a spiritualist or something like that. And they told them, yeah, you know, I heard this is the cure. So some of y'all were given as gifts. I heard to break generational curses. And instead of these people treat you as such, they treated you like shit. And now they need you. And they can't have no access to you. The only reason they'll get access to you, fam, is if you allow it. Like real shit. Yeah, somebody could have a twin sister. It keep coming up about twins. Yeah. Yeah, Virgo, Aquarius energy. But let's get y'all some Zodiacs. I was not expecting this at all. Yeah, I cut the deck on Taurus. So some of y'all could be Taurus. You know what, fam? I would also, something here is about Thanksgiving, and I would really be mindful of whose food it is that I'm eating. Like, because I see somebody inviting y'all somewhere, but it's on some bullshit. Because I really do see, like, somebody having plates, and they like her, and they're like, nah, nah, this is her plate, and this is, yeah, like, what the fuck? They both the same, right? Nah, they're not. Some ain't right. Mm-mm. Yeah, it's best to, if you don't cook your fam, you don't eat it. Push that plate to the side, because somebody, and then they, looking, then they looking at you to see if you're going to finish the food. Why they watching you so tough? Getting pissed off, because you're like, nah, I'm not hungry. Yeah, what the fuck is that about? Red flag. Holy Spirit. Yeah, we got the moon card. Somebody definitely got tricks up their sleeve. But I'm telling y'all, this moon that we have is very significant. Pisces, Scorpio. Hold on, fam. 2333. Fam, let me tell y'all the phone call that I just got as I'm giving y'all this message. So this lets me know that this message has a part two. So I ordered some things from a, a metaphysical store because I'm running a little low, right? And I just get a call that the person that's supposed to bring the things got into a car accident. Yeah. So there is definitely, if this, you know what that tells me? If this person right here, this mother figure, if they try to come up against you, spirit is going to turn they ass a new one, 2414. So some of y'all could be seeing 414 as well. Yeah, this person, they really should rethink this shit. Because, they, you know, nothing that happens in a reading is a freaking coincidence. And then I was asked if I wanted a refund. So it's like, whatever this person took from you, it's going to be given back to you. And then I'm here with added incentives. 2444. Somebody right here, they better stand the fuck down. Yeah. Cancer energy on the bottom of the deck. So we got all three water signs. So it's a water sign out here. Either that's on some bullshit or water signs. It's somebody playing around in your energy. They're trying to fuck with your sacral chakra for sure. 
for shit show. Somebody trying to mess with your sacral chakra. So let me tell you something right now. And I don't even mean to like be, you know, like on that type of time with y'all. But if you do a lot of self-pleasuring, it's not the time for that. I really don't feel like it's the time for that because somebody right here, they're trying to cipher energy from you any way that they can at this time because they know that physically they cannot get close to you. Holy Spirit, what's the signs associated with this message? February the 10th, February the 12th is very significant. We got Sagittarius here. July the 4th, July the 12th, July 14th. July 10th, April 7th, April 10th, April 4th, so 4-4. Four, four. I just heard September the 9th, so 9-9. Nine, nine. Yeah, we get Capricorn right here. Holy Spirit, can I get two more cards, please? Can I get two more? We got Taurus. Can I get one more card, please? Oh, thank you. We got two. So we got Sun and we got Fire. So we got Pisces, Scorpio, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Taurus. This could be someone's Moon or Sun sign. Also, we got Fire, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius right here. Yeah, but the moon right here to fire in the sun, whatever this is, it's going to be illuminated to you. I love it when spirit give us these messages. I love it. Because them motherfuckers be really thinking they finna get the one up on us. Hell no, nah, spirit going to always have our back and they plans going to always go to shit. And they wonder why them they be going through so much karma and everything else. This is ridiculous. But anywho, fam, that's the message that I have for you. Hopefully, it gave you some type of clarity. If it did, y'all, please hit the like button for me. Comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff, y'all. Personal readings are open. If you are interested, all of that information can and will be found in the description box of the channel. It's always my pleasure, of course, fam. I thank y'all so, so much for allowing me to read for y'all. I'm sending you guys love and healing energy wherever y'all may be in this crazy ass world, fam. And we'll most definitely get back up.